this already. We at 11:45. Welcome back to Industries TV, and today we're gonna be talking about two Brooklyn drill rappers, 22 G's and 26 AR. So before we get into this video, y'all already know the routine, man. Make sure y'all smash that like button, and if you're not subscribed to this channel, make sure you subscribe with post notifications turned on. So 22 G's decided to post 26 AR just got boom. Followed by left that boy inside all on Leffert's Boulevard. Now, if that was 100% true, that is an easy indictment. Why would you come on the internet and tell on yourself? Now, I'm not condoning anything that dude is talking about, but if you're gonna do a crime, why would you come on the internet and snitch on yourself? Or even if it's not you and it's your mans, it's your peoples that hit you up and say, oh, we did this, we did that. Why would you come on the internet and tell on yourself? Now, we don't know if this is 100% true because 26 AR responded by saying, the F, is you manifesting this, clout clown? Then he continued to say, tell 22 the difference between us is I go on early morning rampages, not rants, little guy. Then 22 G's responded by saying, he almost died last time. Get the F off of IG for I spend all my money. Now, like I said before, this is an easy indictment. Now, if something happens to 26 AR, even if 22 G's had nothing to do with it, him or his crew, they gonna be the first people that the police investigate just by him making those threats. Why would you make threats on the internet? Make it make sense. But 22 G's continue by saying, I'ma give y'all one warning, followed by come out here and get torched like Fabio. Now, if y'all don't know what 22 G's is talking about, last time Fabio was in Atlanta, he was shot at and his truck was riddled with bullets. Oh, like this, look at this. Already, we at 11.45. Shoot, shoot. Fast, bro, that fast. Look at this, look at this, man. You don't need to hold me a bit, dog. Now, that footage I just seen is from two years ago when Fabio was in Atlanta and had a club appearance. Before he could get in a club, somebody ran down on his truck and sprayed the whole truck up, as y'all can see. Now, I don't know why 22 G's will want to take credit for doing that. At the end of the day, I don't believe that he had any connection to that. I don't believe that he did any of that. But it's not what I believe. It's what the police believe. Because if they didn't catch who did that, they might start investigating him or anybody he's around for doing that. But with that being said, let me know what y'all think down below in that comment section. And if y'all not subscribed to this channel, make sure y'all subscribe with post notifications turned on.